What is shaking guys? Welcome back. This week's video is gonna be really short, or at least I'm going to try to make it short. It's mostly going to be about Toontown and what we want to see from Toontown, or if it won't be Toontown much longer. Depends on how you look at it. But before we dive right into that, I just want to say thank you guys. We finally hit 50 subscribers. So as promised, I will be putting out a special video about what park or what idea almost made DCA not happen. I don't want to give too much away, but stay tuned for most likely Sunday with the park adventure video or Monday, no later than Monday, it'll be up on here. So guys, again, thank you so much. I do this for you guys. I have a lot of fun doing this and I hope to keep growing. I'm, we're still kind of small here, but eventually we will get bigger, much more park stuff, and more just interesting things to share with you guys, like this next video that I'm eventually going to put out for you guys, commemorating this milestone of this channel. So guys, without further ado, let's just jump into today's topic of Toontown. So yeah, let's do this. So as we all know, Toontown is slowly and slowly fading, literally. The paint wears really fast because there's absolutely no shade in Toontown. It's always hot and it's kind of a forgotten land of Disneyland. They haven't, there's been nothing new, nothing to kind of draw, draw interest from guests. So my first question is, what do you guys want to see happen to Toontown? Do you want it to stay Toontown? Do you want it to disappear? Do you want it to become some Fantasyland expansion? You know, just say, Toontown, you had a nice run, see you later. Do you wanna see some money put into Toontown? I mean, they're doing so much other construction, they're not fixing what's already there. You know, so if you fall into that cloud, let me know in your comments, guys. Let me know what you guys want to see with Toontown. I'm on the side of, I like Toontown. I loved it when I was little. I still love it, it's still nice, but it needs, it definitely needs some work. I'd rather see them work on Toontown and Tomorrowland than build Marvel Land right now. But we all know that's not gonna happen. Marvel Land's definitely coming for all of that, but I would like to see that. I know most likely, I mean, I'm 85% sure that the true outcome of Toontown will eventually, Toontown will be no more. That space will become a Fantasyland expansion. I just, Fantasyland needs the upgrade, and I feel that that whole back of the park will fall by the wayside and get taken over by Fantasyland. But I would love to see more stuff in Toontown, more attract, I mean, just one more ride. Just one more ride would just sum it all up, you know, would just add something else rather than Roger Rabbit and the Go Coaster. Yeah, you have Mickey and Minnie's house, those are cool. Donald's not what it used to be. Goofy's bounce house, bounce house. So Goofy's house is not what it used to be. Chippendales, obviously, it's just a tree house now that hardly, if you're not a little tiny kid, you have problems with. And there's nothing there. It's just go up the tree house and walk down the stairs and back. There's nothing. So I know space is limited, especially now with Star Wars land, and Toontown is right up against I-5, so there's not a lot of space. But I just, ah, it just hurts knowing that Toontown will eventually disappear. So guys, leave your comments. I wanna know what you guys think. Like I said, I wanted some money invested into Toontown. It's not gonna happen. I know this. It is going to eventually be a Fantasyland expansion. So just really quick, if they do do a Fantasyland expansion, which they are going to do sometime in the future, can't say how far ahead, but eventually it's gonna happen. What do you guys wanna see? Do you guys wanna see another mountain like a Seven Dwarves Mine Train? Or do you just wanna be a more, uh, you know, a couple more dark rides or, you know, what do you guys wanna see from a Fantasyland expansion since that's gonna take over Toontown? That's a lot of space. The stage will probably, the Fantasyland Theater will probably go by the wayside. Toontown will be gone. That's a lot of space, guys. It's a lot, a lot of space. So let me know what you guys think about a Fantasyland expansion. Let me know 
what do you think about Toontown? Just all of your opinions about Toontown, Fantasyland, leave your comments down below. And guys, I told you I was gonna keep this short and I hope this is as short as I hope it was. So guys, thank you again so much for hitting that goal of 50 subscribers. I know it's not big, but it is greatly, greatly appreciated. Once again, I do this for you guys. I have a lot of fun doing this, looking at your guys' comments, going out and when I take my trips, doing park adventure videos, and I just wanna continue growing, and that is up to you guys. And so far, so good. I hope you guys enjoy, and yeah, thank you again. So, guys, if you haven't done so already, give me a, give this video and this channel a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when other videos like this are uploaded as long as, uh, uh, as well as other park adventure videos. Plus, like I said, the special 50 subscribers special video that will be uploaded no later than Monday. So, guys, thank you again. You guys are at the park. Tell Mickey I say hi and enjoy your weekend. Stay safe with the heat, guys. It's hot everywhere in California right now. And stay hydrated, stay safe. Enjoy Disneyland when it's hot, the crowd's thinning. So enjoy, guys. So I will see you all a little later.